Hey, what's up, college football guy? Here another video. Well, middle of the day, I'm kind of taking my lunch break and uh, thought I'd deliver something here that I promised yesterday in a way. It was about taking a look at some of the transfer portal quarterbacks, the ones who signed, confirmed, and we'll see where they go. But first and foremost, let's get the housekeeping out of the way. Everyone, please smash the like button. It helps with the algorithm. It helps with the analytics. It helps the video be seen by more people. Comment on the video. I love interacting with everybody. And subscribe to the channel. We're on our way to 300 subscribers, almost there. So, here we go. First off, some of the quarterbacks that have moved here. And there's three of them I've paid attention to who haven't made a decision yet. One apparently is close. We'll see. Um, Tanner Mordecai from SMU. Takes his 33 touchdowns, 10 INTs, and 3,500 plus yards to Wisconsin. Which is the reason why Graham Mertz... And his 19 touchdowns and 10 INTs, 2,136 yards, who's been a disappointment. He gets to be from being a disappointment in Wisconsin to possibly improving or still being a disappointment in Florida. Uh, Shador Sanders, we already know about him from Jackson State. 40 TD, 6 INTs, 3,700 plus yards. Going to Colorado, following his dad. JT Daniels, how the money have fallen. It was at West Virginia. Takes his 13 touchdowns, 9 INTs, 2,100 plus yards to Rice. Wow. DJ Ugalele. Hope I said that name right. If I didn't, I apologize. 22 touchdowns, 7 INTs, 2,500 plus yards going from Clemson to Oregon State, which is one of the reasons why one of the backups, one of the guys I night, I had a chance to meet him briefly was Chance Nolan. Uh, he used to be a. Uh, <laughs> I, uh, that's a story for another time, but I met the, met this young man, um, seven TDs, eight INTs, 939 yards. He left and went in the portal as soon as they announced that J DJ was coming, so he left and went in the portal. Good luck for him in his future. Kedon Zlovis from Pitt, 10 TDs, nine INTs, just shy of 2,400 yards. He's not going to BYU, which... We'll get in, I'm going to do a little review on all these when I get them done. Hudson Carter was the Texas quarterback, supposed to be the guy. Uh, six TDs, one INT, 928 yards this season. He decided to go to Purdue, get out of Texas. And with Arch Manning coming in, that's not a bad idea. Uh, and Cade McNamara, who didn't put up any really numbers. I mean, one TD, one INT, 180 yards this season. He decided to go to Iowa, just to stick it, stick it to Michigan. Um <clears throat> I mean, interesting. Wisconsin losing Graham Mertz and picking up Tanner Mordecai. That's a that's I think that's a pickup for them. Shadur Sanders going to Colorado. Obviously, that's a pickup for Colorado. JT Daniels to Rice. He's the biggest name. I think he's the biggest name quarterback they've ever had at Rice. I mean, I could be wrong. If someone wants to look that up for me, please let me know down in the comments. But I think it's the biggest one. DJ going to Oregon State, trying to resurrect his career. It. Oh, it did Bo Nick some good going to Oregon, but Oregon's Oregon. Um, Oregon State, we'll see what DJ can do. Hudson Card going to Purdue. Get out of Texas, go to Purdue. The expectations are nowhere near as big. He has a chance to try to rebuild his career, so for him, I think it's a good move as well. Drew Pine leaving Notre Dame for Arizona State. Got out of Notre Dame. Because you know, the fact that and got out and he left and went to Arizona State, he's going to be the man at Arizona State. There is very little doubt of that. So he'll be the man at Arizona State. Cade McNamara going to Iowa. I don't know if that was for a playmaking decision or was for pure spite. I don't know. Um, but they do need a quarterback at Iowa. Now, the three quarterbacks that I brought up, I brought up Chance Nolan. He's in the portal right now. I don't know where he's going. Sam Hartman was at Wake with his 38 touchdowns, 12 INTs, 3,700-plus yards, I mean, supposedly, according to all the portal crystal balls, he's going to Notre Dame, but that's crystal balls don't mean nothing until you actually do something. And Spencer Sanders with his 17 touchdowns, 9 INTs, and 2,600 plus yards, he's also in the portal. No clue where he's going. Um, would Spencer Sanders go to Pitt to replace Keaton Slovis? Would he go there? Uh, I don't think Spencer's going to Clemson because Clemson's got the, that. I forgot his name. The young kid who played against Tennessee in the bowl. He's he's got a future. He's got a future. I am wondering if Clemson has a future right now until they start figuring a few things out. But that's another story for another day. Um, 
I want to know what your opinion about some of these guys are. Do you think Tanner going leaving SME for Wisconsin was a good move? Shador Sanders going to Colorado was a great move. JT Daniels moving on. D went to Rice. DJ's now at Oregon State. Keaton Slovis is at BYU. Hudson Cards at Purdue. Drew Pine at Arizona State. Graham Mertz at Florida. Kate McNamara at Iowa. What do you think about those and about the guys who haven't signed yet? Ideas on I know you don't and don't know most of you don't know who Chance Nolan is. That was one for me because I'm I know him so I I have a chance to meet him talk with him briefly so uh, that's for me that's personal I just put that out there for me but uh, for Sam Hartman and Spencer Sanders where do you think they're going to go so let me know down in the comments you think about this one so thanks everybody for watching the video this guy is almost okay I thought he was going to hit me with his truck <laughs> he came in the hard way and just did something crazy so thanks everybody for watching this video hope everybody has a great day remember please like comment and subscribe thanks everybody and please be good to each other